A group of young people within the ruling All Progressives Congress wants the caretaker committee led by Governor Mimalabuni to be dissolved. The progressive youth movement is dissatisfied with the failure of the committee to conduct a national convention six months after its mandate. Habila Darafai was at the Northwest Town Hall meeting of the group. His report is presented from our studios. Youth of All Progressive Congress converged on Cardinal to express their displeasure over the inability of the party's caretaker committee to conduct a national convention for more than two years. There are members of the Progressive Youth Movement whose convener, Prince Mustafa Audu, alleged that the party's leadership have provided room for the APC to be hijacked by intruders. The young people have now resolved to constitute a new caretaker, an extraordinary convention planning committee that we hold a convention in February. You should begin to support young people who are confident and bold enough to stand up to the older people who have destroyed this great country, Nigeria. Nigeria, in my opinion, should be the greatest country on the planet, yet we are a giant on our knees. Only young people can get us back on track. We have the capacity to do it and we are ready to do it. Other members of the group say they are ready to fight Governor Buni's wrong, but they want him to resign as the caretaker chairman of the party. I want him to resign because he has overstayed his welcome. He was supposed to spend six months. He has spent one year and another six months. And a party like APC should not be having the kind of problem we are having. Since they have come in as caretaker, aside from the own those state election, we have lost every other election. Clearly, we need a leadership that is uh, well put in place, not a caretaker party, I mean, a caretaker leadership. We joined the APC. We did not join with any social contract with the president. We joined because we believed Nigeria needed change. We joined because we believed in the vision of President Mohamed Buhari. But unfortunately for us, the party has been hijacked. The party has been hijacked. So as founding members of the APC, we are back here today to say that how we have taken our party back. From today, inshallah, the CECPC, the Extraordinary Committee that was set up to, um, to embark on planning the convention, we've decided to sack them. Power belongs to the people. We live in a democracy. That it is ready, we take the lead now. It is either now or never. We are not trying to, you know, um, 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 fight the establishment of the APC or the establishment of other um, organizations or, or leadership, but we're trying, you know, to encourage more youths to be part of the movement and then to be part of leadership. Honestly, the 35% affirmative action has not been given for a very long time. It should be taken. That is why we're here. But I believe, I believe that now is the time. The youth believe it's time for them to take over and they're banking on the majority of the APC's membership being young people. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.